Right now, a local hat shop recently had some help with getting its name out on a national level. Uh, yeah, the helpers are names of people perhaps you recognize. Country music star Morgan Wallen, as well as Post Malone, Ooh. Sacra Gray, live in Vacaville to explain all of this. Hey, Sacra. That's right, guys. This business is the epitome of shoot your shot. OK, so this morning we're joining Bart Bridge and take a look behind me. This is just an example of some of the different hats that they sell everywhere from Vacaville to Rockland, Elk Grove. Small towns is what they really focus on. And when it came to their dream collaboration, they really thought about who they wanted to see their hats on. And they said Morgan Wallen or Post Malone. And take a look, dreams do come true. There you see Morgan Wallen in his Hancock County hat. And not just that, let's roll the music video. Take a look at their new latest music video where I had some help. You'll recognize that hat on the head. And I'm joined here with Luke and Ashley with Bart Bridge. Good morning, guys. Good morning. So tell us a little bit about the story behind how this all went down. Um, basically, did a little research and uh, whipped up a Hancock County, Tennessee hat. That's where Morgan Wallen's from. And uh, sent it to his record company and didn't think much of it. And then Ashley texted me one day and she said, is this real? And sent me a picture of Morgan Wallen wearing the hat, you know, for his new music video. And we were thrilled, yeah. Tell us about what the reaction was when you saw it. Because you sent it not expecting that you would see it or be able to follow up. When you saw it in the music video, what went through your mind? Oh, we had goosebumps. Like you said, I texted him. I said, pinch me. Is this really happening? Um, and they kind of teased the photo. And then next thing, there were teases, like clips of the music video. Mm -hmm. And we were just counting down the minutes till it came out. He wears it the entire music video. He does not do an outfit change. Tell us a little bit about your business because you guys really focus on small towns that maybe are forgotten when it comes to merch, right? Yeah, we love small towns. If we have a day off, we get in the car and we drive around Northern California. It's like our favorite thing to do. And so, yeah, we basically settled on making hats um, with um, images for small towns. And the reception has just been awesome. We love going to these small town fairs and showing the hats and people love them. And you're the epitome of dream big, right? You never know. It could Your dream could work out for you. In fact, you, there's been other celebrities that have been seen wearing your hats as well. Athletes, uh, we, Lady Gaga's boyfriend, I think we saw wearing your hats. What's been, I mean, you're seeing your dream come true. What's next for you guys? Oh, I don't know. We just keep going. I'd love to see Post Malone in the hat next. Yeah, Post, come on now. You and Morgan can be matching. And then we were, you know, Scott and I were just trying to find some hats that meant something to us. So we got Redondo Beach for Scott. Wonderful. And then, of course, can't forget about Cowgirl Sack. We got Houston, Texas. Yeehaw. So, hey, if you're from an area where typically you're not able to find merch, they've got a hat for quite literally everything. And if they don't have that city or that county, they'll make it. That's the kind of people that they are.